And time now to take a look at our weather. We've had a great day. We're looking for more coming up ahead. Let's see if Derek can deliver. Well, I think I can. Vic, it looks like we're going to have a couple, uh, actually, about three more nice days before things start going downhill a bit as we get into the weekend. It looks like this weekend the best chance for rain is going to occur Sunday afternoon and evening, but we do have some chances for showers on Saturday, but we'll worry about that later. We've got some nice weather on the way. Here's a look at your weather headlines here for tonight. And as you can see, we've got three more nice days on the way. Temperatures are going to be in the 80s starting tomorrow and continuing through Friday. So a very warm stretch headed our way. As a matter of fact, some areas on Thursday afternoon could reach the upper 80s with a cooler pattern taking hold into next week as we get a little bit of a change in the jet stream across the area. Currently out at the airport, we're looking at temperatures into the low 60s there. This is out of BWI Thurgood Marshall. Humidity has been very low. The, the humidity actually has been in the teens during the afternoon. Now we're starting to creep up a little bit. The moisture is slowly coming back to the area, and that's going to set us up for that chance for some showers here coming up on Saturday and better chances on Sunday. As you can see, temperature wise across the metro, anywhere from 54 in Falston, Perry Hall at 60 degrees. Inside the Beltway, though, we're looking at temperatures in the low to mid 60s. Inner Harbor at 65, down towards Anne Arundel County, Howard, and Carroll County right now into the mid to upper 50s. Here's your day as a whole tomorrow. High expected to be around 83 degrees. Temperatures by mid morning into the 70s and getting up to around 80. Zero chance for rain in the forecast. Lots of high clouds have been streaming to the area here this evening. We expect the same thing overnight tonight. You can see where they're coming from. So we'll start tomorrow off with a few high clouds across our area. But you see that little swirl right there? That's an upper level disturbance that is now over Louisiana that's going to slowly make its way up our, towards our area here by the time we head towards Saturday. So notice here, next few days, going to be just fine. But then watch how this thing just sneaks its way up into the region. And by the time we head towards late Friday into Saturday, we've got some chances for showers in the forecast. Now our Sunday's rain chances are going to come with a cold front that will be coming in again later in the weekend. That will be late Sunday, but that's going to set us up for cooler weather next week. Statewide, temperature-wise, uh, looking like this, 69 out towards McHenry and Garrett County, but everybody else running in the 80s, Cumberland all the way eastward towards Elkton and down towards the eastern shore. We're looking at temperatures into the low 80s. First alert, seven-day forecast. Next three days look great. Temperatures really cranking up mid to upper 80s here Thursday and Friday. Chance for rain Saturday, better chance Sunday, and then cooler with highs in the 60s next week. I deliver you did. Yes. All right. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Appreciate it. For more first alert weather and updated news, check it with Cena Gabra Ab, Stefan Dingle, and Abigail Degler tomorrow morning on WJZ starting at 4:30. But right now.